Up next, how to pick the right size solar battery. Hi, I'm Jonathan Green from Tayho, the place where Australians save time and money as they make the switch to renewable energy. Check out our website for more information and subscribe below for some more great renewable energy content. It's hard to hide from the fact that solar batteries are the talk of the town. With so many Australians already having installed solar, a solar battery is the next thing on their list. People without solar are keen to install a solar and battery system together to have ultimate autonomy. Plus, there are also a few battery rebates floating around Australia as a sweetener. At Tejo, we get asked every day, which size solar battery is right for me? Without complicating the whole exercise, there are a few ways you can determine which battery size is right for you. What are your goals? The first question to ask yourself is what are you trying to achieve? This will depend on one of two things. Whether you already have solar and you're interested in adding a battery or if you have nothing and you're installing solar and a battery together. A few things to think about. Are you trying to eliminate your electricity bill? Do you want to use your battery in a blackout for an essential circuit? If so, how much storage will you need? Are you trying to capture all your excess solar from your existing system rather than sending it to the grid? How do you size a battery if I have existing solar? If you have an existing solar system, you'll need to sit down and work out how much solar you are exporting to the grid. This excess solar is what will be stored in the solar battery. If what you are sending back to the grid from your existing solar system will help you achieve your battery storage goals, find a battery size that is suitable based on these numbers and install the battery. If there isn't enough solar being sent back to the grid from the existing system, an increase in system size with a new system to work alongside the existing system may be required. If your existing system is getting quite old, a new bigger system to replace the old smaller system might also be a good idea. How do you size a battery if you have nothing? The best way to size a battery system without an existing system is by understanding your energy usage, your goals and determining the right size battery for you. If you are wanting to install a battery to achieve full autonomy, first take a look at how much electricity you are using. Then determine how much you use at night and how much you use during the day. Don't waste your time on getting it perfect. It will never be perfect. How do I work out the best size battery for blackout protection? The easiest way to work out what size battery is best size battery if you require it mostly for blackout protection is working out what you want to be powered in a blackout. Understanding what you want to back up, how much it will draw and how long you'd like it to run the appliance at a minimum. Those with existing solar will need to consider if the solar system you currently have installed will meet the storage requirements of the battery with excess solar. Those who don't have solar will need a system installed that will do just that. Tejo tip. Some batteries have blackout protection and some don't. Others only back up small loads while others can handle large loads. If backing up appliances at your home is important to you, have this conversation with your energy expert at Tejo to determine which battery manufacturer will work best for you. Module batteries versus one size fits all battery. Each battery manufacturer offers an entirely different solution. For example, the Tesla battery is a 14 kilowatt hour battery with 13 and a half kilowatt hours of usable battery storage. There isn't a smaller or bigger size battery. While Sonnen is a battery manufacturer that is modular, it increases in two and a half kilowatt increments up to 15 kilowatt hours in their hybrid range. Once you've worked out which is the best size solar battery for your needs, you will then need to determine which battery is going to be best for you to install. 
Other things to consider is the degradation of the battery, output of the battery, cell chemistry, and the warranty. Choosing a battery size, even with all the research in the world, can still be tough. If you are considering a home storage solution like a battery, reach out to Teho and speak to an energy expert today. Give us a call on 1300 22 92 92 or check out our website at www.teho.com.au. That was how to pick the right size solar battery. I'm Jonathan Green from Teho. Thanks for watching.